Okay. y'all so I made it back to Alabama I had an issue with this camera and uh, I think it's an SD card issue anyway I fooled with it a little bit and imported a little bit of stuff that I videoed this morning wasn't much because the camera wouldn't act right but anyway got the uh, uh, hog traps freshen back up so we'll see what happens there but anyway got the camera back going i like this little camera this is that a little olympus tough cam it's just very seldom have any issues with it but uh i uh was this morning but anyway uh gonna see what else i'm gonna do the rest of the day man all right y'all so here's what i decided to do i did a few things around the house and i uh actually i'm looking at my camera oh i actually had some of my climbing stuff out and i didn't did video any i'm trying to figure out which one i like the best uh, i played with my new bullman the uh silent approach outdoor whatever it's called bullman bullman outdoors the plastic steps and straps i played with them for a little bit and then i got my my three i got i got four muddy pro sticks or whatever they are, the 20 inch or whatever they are, and the aider. I climbed up with the uh, Bullman Outdoor stuff and then I come back down and got my uh, the sticks and the aider. That is what I like. It's just a little bit heavier, but I just feel a lot better with that. I get a little bit higher with less stuff, so I don't know. I'm still playing with that. I'm just kind of like this camera I'm using. This is the Canon XA11, I believe what it is, XA11 or whatever. Oh, I just like the quality of this camera. It's kind of like the sticks. It's just a little bit heavier, but man, I'm trying to bring out some good quality. And I have taken my external mic off, and I'm what I'm using right now, and I'm going to test this a little bit. I tested it in one of the previous videos at the end. I'm testing the audio this just on the camera itself. It's got three three mics and I put my little whisker things over it to uh, help with the wind noise. So studying on that, uh, boy I tell you it's just a lot. I just always my mind's always spinning trying to get this thing better and all and but you wanna stay light when I get ready to start hunting the public stuff or even on our private stuff. I don't want to just get too heavy. But I'm going to try to figure out how I can keep using this camera because I, I really like it. Oh, what else was I thinking about? Oh, as I watch the hunting public guys a lot and I watch oh, uh, Catman Outdoors and, and oh, uh, you know, I don't even know his name, the Catman Outdoors. He, uh, he's more like me as far as always 99% of the time by itself the hunting public guys you know they all nine times out of ten and sometimes they don't but most of the time they got somebody with them so that helps on the equipment but I kind of like what the cat man does so I need I, sometimes I want to carry two cameras like to have a GoPro up there pointing at me and all but you just get into so much junk it almost takes the point out of hunting so for now 
uh, most of the time I, I am going to uh, just have the one camera and uh, keep working on that. And, uh, but anyway, just always thinking and trying to get better. And I decided I'm going to run off down here to Knoxby, uh, over in Mississippi, and, and hunt this afternoon. I'm going to go to a spot that's, that's already got the steps up. And I ain't even got no camouflage on. Got some brown car hard pants on. <laughs> I've just got so many leaves on the trees. I think I'll be all right. I'm just going to climb up and try to have a good afternoon and see if we can get lucky. I've been just kind of bouncing around. I ain't hunting the same spot yet. Of course, we ain't hunted much. But anyway, I'm headed on down and we'll we'll see how this quality is on the. I know the camera's fine, uh, but I got to work on the audio. And also, uh, I've never fooled with these manual settings. I just kind of film on auto. I want to play with that some, but uh, that'll probably come later. I may do that if I'm sitting in a shooting house or something or get in there where I got a little time to play with. But I really enjoy doing this film and I really don't want to go hunting without some sort of camera all the time. I may get lazy and use my little camera some and, and it's not bad. I just noticed the other day when I film with the uh, film with it is the quality is just ooh, it's just not quite there but it's not bad especially you get into different lighting situations but it's not it's not too bad I mean it'll work especially where I really notice it's fine is like bow hunting the deer in their clothes but it's just just not quite it's not near as good as what I'm holding in my hand right now but we just keep working at it we got to have options but let's go see if we can see a deer
started blowing. Might not, might not be safe. All right, y'all, another fun hunt, another fun afternoon hunt in the saddle. Had, uh, saw a bunch of deer this evening and saw several turkeys. Not sure how good, how good the footage is. That tree up there's got so many leaves on it, I couldn't hardly see anything, but had a couple shot opportunities this afternoon, just didn't take them. I am, I guess I'm waiting around on a big one. I'm gonna have to fire a shot before long, but, oh. Uh, Every time I go in the saddle, I learn something. Uh, I think that's the first, I can't remember if that's the first time I've used the big camera with a big big uh, camera arm. I think it's the first time. But anyway, I didn't have it set up just like I needed to. Every time I get up there, I see something different I need to do and all that. I'm about to get pretty happy with my pack. Uh, I'm afraid before it's over with, I'm gonna end up back with the Eber, st the Eber stock just because you can get a little more organized and it's a little bit bigger and I think it'd be better and I don't think the weights don't make that much difference but anyway that's why we're going we got to keep learning having a good time I enjoy sitting up there in that saddle but anyway I have to call it a day appreciate y'all watching out of here